watching my channel. I just wanted to talk a little bit today about safe sleep because this is something very important that can really save some children's lives. So first of all, we talk about the ABCs of sleep. So some people are like, ABCs, what does that mean? The first one is alone. So as you can see, I have my very safe baby here and he's alone in the crib. That's very important. You don't want to be sleeping with your baby, especially if you're breastfeeding. I know sometimes it can get very tiring when you're breastfeeding, it makes you tired. But you want to leave the baby alone. B is on the back. You want to make sure the baby's on the back. I know that a lot of times your friends and your family members would say, oh, baby sleeps much better like this on the tummy. This is a big no-no. Although babies might sleep on their tummy better, that does not necessarily mean that it is safer. If your baby is on the back and then were to spit up, all they have to do is move their head a little bit to whichever side they want and they can spit up and it's fine. If for whatever reason, the, some of the spit up would stay in the mouth, it will just go into the stomach and it's not a big deal. What happens is if they are on their back, if they're on their stomach like this, and they were to spit up and they were to swallow it, by gravity it would actually enter into the lungs and that's how they can uh, choke on it. So it's very important, always flat on the back. So we have A, alone, B, on the back, and C is very important and that's sleep in a crib. You can have the baby in a bassinet or you know some, something that's a safe sleep if you want, but it has to be in a safe area. The baby cannot sleep in the bed with you or in any pillows, anything like that. You want to have the baby in a hard surface, so definitely not in a pillow, and you want to have the baby in tight-fitting crib sheets. You don't want to use those borders either because babies, they, they uh, don't really circulate the oxygen very well if they have those borders. So you want to make sure that you have A alone, B on the back, and C, of course, in a nice crib. Thank you very much for watching and I really hope that this made a difference.